Hello guys, LittleBuddy524 here, and welcome back to another episode of A Whole New World. So glad to be back. I have been really busy with school lately, so I'm kind of just recording this in between sort of deal. Oh, we're going to push this button just because I want to show it to you again. Slap of the button. Oh yeah, closed up. Okay, so yeah, so I've been um, kind of busy with school lately. Haven't really had much time to record. So I'm going to bring this one out to you guys. I've had really good ideas lately. Um, I think this area right here is going to turn into like the castle's village. Um, I know a lot of castles have little villages inside the walls. But I think this one's going to be outside. I haven't really done much research on castle villages and stuff like that. Where they go or whatever. But <clears throat> I think it should be... Should be kind of cool. I've gotten... I'm kind of hitting a wall on this castle, literally. I... It's not... Uh, well, not literally, but figuratively I'm hitting a wall. Because I've, I've kind of hit a block in my building. I'm kind of out of inspiration at this point. And I think it's just because I'm trying to take on a task that I've never done before. And a castle's... That castle is a lot harder to build than any other castle I've ever built. I've built like square, you know, s square castles like four, you know, where it goes like boom, 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 boom. You got your, you got your one tower here, one tower here, and one tower over here and here. And then there's walls in between that connect them. And then there's like a courtyard in the middle, but I don't know. I didn't, I wanted to build something different. And... I thought, what better thing to do than to sharpen up my building skills again and use, start using the new materials and things like the different colored woods um, and, and make like a little village. So I'm thinking instead of it being like a, a big, a crazy like, um, like, you know, like modern looking thing like I did last time in my season one world, I think I want to do sort of a sort of an older style looking um, maybe maybe looking like uh, a medieval village sort of deal but not the medieval style necessarily I just want it to have little houses and things like that all over the place so I've been looking at this wall right here and all that I can I can see out of it is a blacksmith so this is gonna be where his forge like the forge is gonna come out here and then I'm going to cart some mine, uh, some villagers over from that village over to here. I believe there's villagers over there. We'd have to go check that out, but I know there's a village over there, so they probably spawned some villagers there. I'm going to cart them over, and they're going to be my little villagers in this area. So I'm going to kind of shape this area, get some um, some smooth stone built up. And maybe if... Actually, you know what? We'll do the floor first. Because this is, can't be because I'm going to have fire. What the heck is this down here? I'll have to fill that in. Or incorporate it somehow. Um, but yeah. I'm going to fill this area in. Or something. I'm not sure really yet. Actually, having it open kind of like that looks kind of nice. What time of day is it? Alright. Um, but. Uh, what can we talk about? Oh, I want to talk about. Um, messages from the battlefield. You'll be seeing that this week for sure. Uh, I have brought that back. I played some Call of Duty uh, last week, I think. In between me doing a project and stuff like that for school. So, um, definitely going to be seeing some of the messages from the battlefield again this week. Hello, live long. Or lifelong. Yeah, so, well, you'll be seeing that and... I don't know if you've seen anything else crazy. I've been thinking about bringing in a, not a, um, either a Total Miner series with Shadow Lord 65, or because they just updated to Total Miner actually, which is great. Can't wait. I've been playing that with uh, Shadow Lord for a bit now, and also. I was thinking a maybe a Forza series, like a Forza Motorsport series, or a another racing game of some sort. This maybe and like that. 
Ooh, maybe this needs to be wider. Yeah, this needs to be wider. Like that, and like that on the other side too, I think. Oh, jeez. Blast right through there. Mm hmm. There. There. That's good. Um, as you guys probably saw at the beginning of this video, I also just got a new intro. Um, I made that one my well with a template that I found on the internet for an intro because I'm not that good with Cinema 4D yet. So. Um, basically all I had to do was put my name in and uh, edit them together so I really didn't do much to that um, although the Call of Duty one I kind of you know you're gonna see that uh, in the next episode of a whole uh, um, messages from the battlefield you'll see that hmm this can't just be plain back there that kind of needs to be um, like in a little bit maybe like that and then put some stairs there or something like that Ooh, it's getting kind of dark out no okay it's just dark here never mind yeah put some maybe like th not like that but I can't re I really can't wait till upside down stairs come you guys probably have heard me say that so many times you're sick of it but I really I'm being honest with you guys I can't it adds so much to the game. The upside down stairs just makes the game look so much better. Um, like for example, see you see this here? I could make that look so much more flush and nice if I had upside down stairs and hopefully even connecting stairs. Um, all right. Wait, I got my one here and one here. So like that, and then maybe I'm going to put some cobblestone and gravel all down here on the floor. Now we need a grinding wheel. How can we make a grinding wheel? Hmm. And I want to make kind of like a workbench over here maybe. Hmm. Um, let's go see what we have in the chest up here. Oh, I figured out the at the end of last episode that... When I dug through this area, just give me a second, I'll show you guys. When I dug through this area, there's this cave here, and I guess it connects right onto my house. <laughs> so, it's kind of a shortcut in there. Um, where do we have that stuff? I don't, oh man, I'm hitting another set of armor. Jeez, I, when I got on here, I was like, oh, my armor's almost dead. So, I made another set. Oh, yeah, gravel. That's what we're looking for. There's definitely gravel in here. If there's not, I'll be really surprised. Mm, this top chest? Gravel, yeah. That's what we need. And some cobblestone. Oh, I hate this new gravel texture. Look at that. It's so gross. Um, It looks really, really, really similar to cobblestone now. Uh, do we need to sleep? Yes. Uh, yeah. Let's go sleep first, and then we can... Then we can get going on this, so... Um, alright. So, I'm gonna get this all... Myself all regrouped here, and... When I get back, we can... Get our stuff all back together again, so... Um, I'm going to just sleep right here, and I will see you guys in just one second. Alright, and we're back. Um, I'm just clearing out an area here. Kind of trying to make it look like, um, it's sort of cut in here properly, and then, um, it looks like it fades out, and that's where we'll put the gravel and stuff like that. Maybe in higher traffic areas we'll put the gravel. that like that maybe okay so place down our cobblestone everywhere oops i missed oop i missed again jeez um 
if you guys noticed a really big chop in the recording there before, I hit the wrong button on my uh, remote sort of deal. And yeah, you may have noticed a little bit of a choppiness. Please forgive me. I was going to say I'll be right back in a minute. I'll be right back or whatever. And I kind of hit it too early. So, all right, we got this down like that. Maybe put some there, there, and there. All right, there's going to be lava all around here. See, look at how similar that looks. Like cobblestone, gravel. Crazy. Um, oh, yeah, put some there. Maybe a piece there. All right, we'll clean up all that dirt in a second. And we're going to put some cobblestone back here, I think, too. Just give it a different texture behind the thing. There we go. And a work, uh, kind of a, I guess, a table to work on here we could try. Put some... Is that too high up? Yep, that's definitely way too high up in the air. That's good that they fixed that right away. As soon as they could, anyways. Um, what can we do here? We want to make like a... I guess we could do the old pressure plate table deal. Let's make a workbench. Um, get you out of there. There we go. Put the workbench down. Actually, and then I want to make this so that it's kind of a functional blacksmith deal. So I want to put furnaces all down here and then um okay we need to make what were we making again oh yeah pressure plates just pressure plates are easy to make go to boom boom like that and get rid of this crap then plop down two pressure plates right there perfect so that's our little workbench Hopefully that doesn't start on fire. If it starts on fire, we'll have to move it or whatever. Um, but we should be good. Uh, I want to put like a grinding wheel or something kind of over here. So let's see what we can do. Grinding wheel. Hmm. See, this is another place where upside down stairs would come handy. Huge. Seat maybe right here and then... Um, no, I don't think we can do a grinding wheel. What else do blacksmiths have? Maybe we should put like a little shelter sort of right here. Oh, no, no, no. Axe, come back. Actually, you know what? Yeah, yeah, okay. We'll make kind of the house of the blacksmith right here. It'll be built into the side of the wall. Okay, we may need to move it over a little bit. Yeah, we're going to need to move it over a little bit. Like, boom, 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 boom. There we go. And one over here, just for now. So, we'll change this up. Make it smooth stone, or whatever we, we decide on for the interior block. This will be the porch right there. And this needs to be put there. Okay, so we'll clear this out then inside, I guess. And just it's just got to be kind of a cozy little home. Doesn't need to be anything too big. He is a blacksmith after all. It's got to kind of look... Um, just kind of like he set up shop here one time and because the blacksmith I think would have been one of the first people to come into the town and then after that there would have been people that settled around the town too see this is the kind of stuff you got to do though you got to make it so that it's so that you have a kind of a storyline to go after to go um, along with uh, yeah this can't be there so, 
I guess we'll just have to. Yeah, right. We're, we're gonna have to move this whole house over one or a couple blocks because we can't have all that stuff in the way. No. Uh oh, missed one. Ah, darkness. Oh my gosh, so dark in here. There we go, and blow, blow through this wall like that. Get the porch going here. And I'll, I'll dress this up a little bit. Um, we're just going to work on the blacksmith today, I think. Because I don't really have time for anything else. So I'm going to I'm gonna dress this up inside. Um, I'm going to go get some more lava for this and start placing down the uh, the furnaces in the bottom of there to make it functional. And I will see you guys as soon as I get back. Which I don't know when that's going to be. One second. Yes. I will see you guys in one second, guys. Guys, I am back. I am back. And I finished this up a little bit. I still got to add a few more things. But I have a fireplace, a little dinner table. And then this is going to be the blacksmith's bedroom. Uh, he's got a little chest here. Going to put a bed in there. But I want to show you guys something really cool that I saw on a uh, Hunger Games map the other day. Um, you guys may have played the Lost City um, Hunger Games map. And look, see this? See, you put them behind here. These, I, these are item frames, by the way, just in case you wanted to know. Put the item frames behind torches. Boink, like that. I better have enough. Should have. There, perfect. Okay, and then you take your half slabs. And you go up to the item frame and click. And it creates this nice holder. It looks um looks really medieval. And oh geez, that's not where that's supposed to go. <laughs> Where's my pickaxe? It's gone. There we go. I died from a creeper, so I'm a little bit um uh a little bit scattered. So there we go. Oh, geez, I did it again. Doesn't that look nice, though? The It looks like it has um, holders for the torches. I thought that was really cool. Um, we're going to just finish this up, and then we will wrap the episode up. There's the blacksmith's entrance. I'm going to shape it a little bit more and things like that. But, you know, a creeper blew up, so these pressure plates are gone. And um, we'll, we'll make some more. Let's see. Nope, we don't have enough, so we're not going to make any more. Um, Alright, let's get the furnaces out of the chest that I made. Hopefully, we have enough. So we're going to do like the first, the front few first. Just in case we don't have enough. So we're going to put there and there. Okay, so we didn't have enough, but uh, that's fine. We'll just fill in the rest with cobblestone. Like that. And now we, this should be fully functional, basically. Um, get as many of these on my bar as I can. See, look at that. You can even click down right underneath us. And now we have a fully functional little blacksmith forge, I guess. I know that real blacksmith forges aren't lava, but... It looks cool. That's what we're going to do for ours. So can we just grab one of these and slam it down somewhere else? I guess not. Okay. So, um, you know what? I really don't like how it's so... Oh, man, that's a lot of iron that just went down the drain. Okay, so right there I'm going to put some stairs, I think. Some... Um, cobblestone stairs right there and that's gonna be our forge uh, maybe put some half slabs around the edge cobble slabs around the edge or I might make brick slab yeah I'll make stone brick slabs off camera put those around so that is it for today we made this wonderful wonderful little blacksmith forge I want to just say thank you all for watching look forward to messages from the battlefield this week 
also let me know how my intro looked for you guys and how it sounded because there is some dubstep music as you guys heard um also if you want me to do a racing series on my channel and a total minor series let me know down in the comments below also leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for later content thank you all for watching and i will see you guys next time